truth is, Ippo, your fists are light. You're gonna need more than that to defeat me. What? Did I miss anything? Son of a... Takamura takes another hit! He's not packing his usual heat! He's taking full-on punches from the challenger! Oh no! Damn, the big guy's totally off his game out there! But that's what happens when you starve yourself before a fight! A right uppercut from Tomaki! He's getting pounded! He's gonna lose if he doesn't fight back! <laughs> the champion is on the run! What the hell's happening to him? I've never seen him back off like that! He wouldn't allow himself to look that bad if he wasn't feeling a hell of a lot worse. <laughs> Another hit right from the challenger! Takamura blocks! Wow, they both hit with the same kind of power. There's no way he's gonna be able to take all that head on. He picks away at his opponent with a series of jabs! He's starting to let his left guard drop! He's getting careless! He's getting killed! That belt is mine! <laughs> ah. Direct hit! The champion's head is twisted back! Stay up! Come on! He shakes it off! The champion stands tall! His feet braced apart, ready for anything! And there's the bell! Round one ends with the challenger on top, with a surprising lead on Takamura! If the champion turns this match around, he could make a new record! 12 consecutive KO victories since his debut as a middleweight. But it's not looking too good for the champ. Records aside, he's got to be more worried about holding on to the title. First round and he's already breathing hard. He's hurting bad. I'm not sure he'll be able to win this one. Don't be a wuss. Doesn't matter if he's battered and half blind. He's going to win this match. The big guy doesn't lose. That's the whole point. That's what makes him great. Yeah, right. He's going to win for sure. Yeah, right. You're getting nailed pretty hard. Don't worry about me. Did you take a look at that guy? There's no way I'll lose to anyone that butt ugly. Mr. Takamura, you can do it! Huh? You gotta fight to win! Rip his head take off! Take him down! Can somebody tell the Three Stooges to put a cork in it? All this drama's kind of embarrassing. You can do it, Takamura! Go! <sighs> it's time for Toxilla to make an appearance. Listen, there's nothing left to say about strategy, but I don't think that's what you need. Corner man out! All right. Just listen till I'm through talking, all right? I know what you want to say. You can do it, Knock it out! Round two! <laughs> he looks determined! He throws his body into him! Huh? But look at that! He's been pushed back instead! Uh, Takamura has butted heads with the wrong ball! Your strength has bottomed out to nothing! <laughs> Tamaki's got him on the ropes and is hammering away! The title is within his reach! He's gotta get out! That's insane! He can't move! The champion's a sitting duck for one brutal blow after another! You're going down. I don't care if you're dragging ass or fresh as a newborn baby. No matter how powerful everyone thinks you are, I'm knocking you down. One more. There's no sign of defeat in those eyes. Haven't my punches done anything to him? Or is this some kind of a setup? Snap out of it! Keep going! Don't stop! Don't stop! <gasps> Whoa! My brain just took a holiday. Why didn't that bastard nail me while he had the chance? Aha! <sighs> uh -huh. You chickened out, didn't you? What happened, tough guy? What's this? The champ is egging him on! <clears throat> He's frozen like a deer in the headlights! The faint with the eyes, good job! Now you got him thinking about it! He's bluffing. There's no way he's not hurting right now. Just one more flurry and it's over. It's over! I was right. He's in real bad shape. Can't even throw a punch. Don't give up! Keep lashing out! What's he doing? Throw your right! 
Another hit! And another! Can this be it for the champ? He tumbles towards the mess! Mr. Takamura! Don't you remember what you told me? All champions have a special power! If that's true, then show me now! Show me your power! <laughs> Here it comes! Set an example for all the small fry in the peanut gallery. They want to be great like me. I can't let him down. I'm putting a dent in him. He's got to be in pain. I trained too hard for him to still be standing. He's just another fighter like me, and I know I can defeat him. Oh! I have the power and the will to stay the champion, but it's not going to be easy. My fists will protect my title and smash this pretender into pulp! You don't know how determined I am, kid! You can never be like me! He did it again! The match is over! He did it! Oh, I never doubted him for even a second! I did, he was very scary! For the third time, Takamura has successfully defended his title with a KO! And now, for a few words with the winner and still champion, Takamura. Great job out there, but was this one of your tougher defense matches? Maybe he'll explain to her about the power of the king. And all those things he was telling me about. Tough? I've broken a bigger sweat playing checkers. I just cut him a little slack to make a better show for everybody. What do you say, people? You have fun or what? <clears throat> You're not fooling anyone! We heard you screwed up your weight because you were too damn busy chasing chicks to stick to your diet! He'll never get a chance to say something meaningful. Well, you know the thing about being the champion. He's gonna say it! Hey there, girl! He's got his eye on you! Don't think he won't make a play for you right there in the ring! If you're lucky, you might have a chance to escape after he gets knocked out! <laughs> ah, they're only kidding. Mm. Are you jokers trying to tell me I'm not popular with the ladies? You see that? She's just happy to be near me! Shut up! I wrote the book on how a champion is supposed to behave! This is horrible! Just stay low or we might get out of this alive! Man, I'm full. That blowfish Yagi brought to my victory party was some good eats. Still, what were you guys thinking with all that cheering crap? You didn't believe that I could lose, did you? Well, it did seem possible. I already told you. Tonight you were gonna see the power of the king! You really did show me something that only champions have. Mm. Do you think my fists are too light? Uh. That's what Mr. Date told me. I thought he was trying to get a rise out of me. But I really paid attention to your defense match. And you're right, I realized there's a huge difference between the champion and the challenger. And that's why you're kicking ass with ten consecutive knockouts. I can't afford to fool myself. He's not the kind of fighter I could ever knock down with a light punch. You have power in your punches. More than Date does. Then what is it? He didn't mean light the way you thought he did. 
How then? Take a look at tonight's match. If it wasn't for the challenger pushing me with all he had, my punches would have actually been a little lighter. There are all sorts of advantages that come with being champion. Every time you go into the ring, your challengers have expectations. Every time they dream of beating you and they look up to you in some way. All of their emotion goes straight into your fist. Emotion? See what I mean? All those feelings weigh a champion's fist down every time he fights. Which means that old man Date's fist gotta be two cinder blocks by now. His fist did feel heavy to me. Filled with the hopes and dreams and fears of everyone that he ever fought. The only thing driving me right now is that I love boxing. But that's it. What kind of mindset do I have to take to the ring when I finally face the champion? Yes, hello? He just lost. What do you mean? Who lost? You sound pretty upset. Yeah, I'm upset because the lightweight champion just lost his belt. Who's holding the title? None other than Mashiba. Oh, Mashiba won? That's great. Good for him. Are you crazy? <laughs> it's bad enough I had to lose, but now I have to make a goal of fighting someone who's not even part of the human race. He's all right. You wouldn't say that if you saw his face when he won. <laughs> Not such a pleasant thought, is it? No. If I gotta fight that maniac, I better go get to work now. Later. So, Mashiba has become a champion. I should talk to him about his whole attitude during the fight and find out if the champion's fist felt heavy. Yes, hello? Hello, how are you? It's Mashiba. Ah! Kumi Mashiba, you remember? Oh, of course, how are you? It's been a while. I'm great. My brother had his big match today. Yeah, I know. I just heard he won the title. That's awesome. Congratulations. Thanks, I'm so proud of him. But that's why I called. I went ahead and planned a celebration for him. But he doesn't have any friends, so nobody's coming over. It's just not much of a party, you know? Could you come over? I'm sure he'll be happy to <laughs> uh, okay, I have to keep it together. I've got to remember to ask him about his take on the title fight. Is anybody there? Oh. Um, hello? You there? It's me, Makinouchi. Come in. Oh, yeah. Um, I'll just come on in then, if it's okay with you. It's pitch black. I can't see anything. Uh, he still has my picture nailed up on the wall. I get it. It's like one of those surprise parties, right? Sit down. <laughs> Know where Kumi is? Out. Oh, yes. I see. She coming back soon? Yeah, when she's done buying something. Oh, I see. She's shopping. <laughs> I want to congratulate you on your big win today. You should be proud of yourself. You really earned it. So how'd it go out there during the fight? What'd you think of your opponent? I heard that he was tough. It couldn't have been too easy. What round did he finally go down, huh? I really hope she gets home soon. The seventh round. Huh? Wow, KO in the seventh round. That's a great fight. But the champion must have really been something lasting as long as he did. I mean, the fact that he went seven rounds against you after you upped your weight class is pretty impressive. And I wondered, is there something special about a champion? Like their style, or their strength? 
Or maybe there's something about their fists that's different. It's nothing, really. So there's no difference? I fought him the way I would anybody else. Longer than usual, perhaps. He just wouldn't quit, so I had to make it ugly. <laughs> His title match and it was all the same? I guess the strongest don't always agree. Huh? What are you doing? Why is it so dark in here? Hello, Ippo. Thanks for coming. Thank you for inviting me. I know it's last minute, but... Everyone at his work was saying that they'd have a party for him in a few days. But I thought that to do it right, we should have one on the same day. Don't you think so? No, you're right. The same day's usually the best time for the victory party. And it's not like he's suffering from fight fatigue. <sighs> That's not the face of someone who had an easy fight. Those 21 minutes he spent fighting were nothing less than a death match. That's the face of someone who fought desperately with everything he had. He put his life on the line for that belt. Hello in there. Huh? Okay, let's have a great time tonight. Uh, put this on if you're not too embarrassed. Congratulations on becoming champion. Congratulations, you did great. <laughs> no, he's not into this. He probably hates it. The fight was so terrifying. <laughs> I had to leave before it was all over. That champ had already defended his title in five earlier matches. But he got him in the seventh. That was some great boxing. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming to the party. You're welcome. But I was really starting to think that I was bringing him down or something. That's not true at all. I could tell you were making him happy. Did you happen to notice those tiny wrinkles that he was getting between his eyebrows? He only gets those when he's trying not to laugh. I haven't seen those wrinkles there in a long time. That's how he looks when he's happy? It must be nice to have a sibling. I would love to have someone who cared enough about me to throw a victory party and celebrate my fights. But unfortunately, I was an only child. Well, your title match is coming up pretty soon, isn't it? Yes, it is. I wanted to thank you for coming by today, so I'm going to throw you a party too, and that way we can celebrate together. <laughs> oh man, I can't believe how cute she looked just now. That's nice, but we're kind of getting ahead of ourselves. I mean, I don't even know if I'll win. It really wasn't much different for my brother. He didn't let on, but I could tell he was nervous before the match. But he did tell me that he would try as hard as he always did, and he left the house this morning as though it were any other day. Oh. You know, I'm not even sure that I'm making any sense. <laughs> like any other day, huh? That's probably a great way to look at it. If you put everything you can into everything you do, your best comes naturally. Doesn't matter who I'm up against, it'll be a good fight. It'll be a fight that I can be proud of. But it's just another fight. That's all there is to it. Thanks for coming with me. I'm gonna run the rest of the way. <laughs> Wait a minute, Ippo! Go and do your best, okay? <laughs> and while you're at it, win that belt! I'll give it everything I've got! Kid, you ready? Yes. An all-around champion versus challenger with great potential. <laughs> Makano Uchi's liver blow is key. But only if he gets to throw it. If he goes for the liver blow, he'll leave himself wide open. And Date will know, because he's waiting to throw his killer punch. He'll throw a heartbreaker the first chance he gets. And even if Ippo dodges the blow, he'll be too curled up to throw the left. All right, jump now, kid! Always stay close enough to take it into a clinch. He needs distance to throw a corkscrew punch, kid. That's the way. Stay close and you'll have nothing to worry about. Yes, sir. All right, now, keep sparring. The Chief's always one step ahead. 
He knows the left won't be able to punch, so he'll block with the left, and he'll stay close enough to smother the corkscrew. He's a sly old fox, but that means Zippo's punching power will be cut in half. There's practically no openings to throw a decent punch. Huh? All right, fellas, that's enough for now. I didn't see that coming. But now that I think of it, there was a champion that claimed that a fist 10 centimeters away from its target could knock a man down. At that range, you'd have to concentrate all your strength into your fist. And Makino Uchi sure has a lot of strength to pull from. I wouldn't miss this match for anything. Mr. Takamura defended his title. And Mashuba took his. And soon, it'll be my turn. waged between a champion and a challenger for the belt. The showdown between the best there is and the boxer that strives to become the next king. I never imagined I'd be in a match like this three years ago, but now I'm dying to climb into that ring as soon as I can. There's nothing holding me back from using all my strength. Next round, the Japan featherweight title match. <laughs> 